the ideal profile is if you have 10 to 15% retail, because that means you could have 1,500 to 2,000 shareholders, a lot of retail, which is great for listing. But if they don't, uh, let's say they have, say, seven or 700 shareholders, but when you go through the redemptions, as NASDAQ wants to see how many accounts are redeeming, then they, they could fall below the 300 count. And that turns out to be a big problem. So, and they can't get the deal done unless they, they're listed on NASDAQ. And then, so it's complex, the rules are complicated. So they call us, we get on the phone and we try to figure out what the rules are, what NASDAQ want, when they want it, depends what type of merger it is. Sometimes they want it before the closing, sometimes they want it after the closing. So it's, it's never easy.